Hey guys, so today I'm going to do another first impressions video on the new Maybelline Baby Skin. I'm so excited to try this. I saw this and I was like, wait a second, I've never seen that before. So let's see, it says get poreless smooth looking skin, instant pore eraser with blur technology. Use alone or under makeup. So I'm. it kind of, I feel like it's going to be like a pore professional by benefit. But let's see, I'm so excited. I've been liking a lot of the um, like pore minimizers lately. I'm, I really like the pore professional a lot. So let's see. This, ugh, I don't remember how much it costs. I'll find out for you, but I don't think it was anything crazy. Let's see. Oh, so it's a clear gel. Ooh, that's interesting. It doesn't smell that great. Mm, right. So it feels heavier, definitely, than the professional. If anyone knows that consistency, I hope it's not too heavy. But it feels almost like a like Vaseline, if you will. It's not as thick or anything like that, but definitely kind of like that consistency it doesn't really smell like anything now that I rubbed it on because at first I was like it is not that good of a smell it has no fragrance really but I guess whatever ingredients they use you can definitely smell that but now that I worked it in it really doesn't have any fragrance at all which is good because if that original smell lingered on I would not be happy with that so now as I'm working it through and my skin's like absorbing it it feels really good. I like it. Um, it does feel kind of like it oily. I mean, I hope my skin absorbs all of it. And I didn't use that much. I don't think I used that much at least. Okay, my skin's definitely absorbing it, which is good. Focus it right over here, because this area is where pores are more noticeable. I think for anyone, really. Um, looking in the mirror, it does feel like a little smoother. It does look a little smoother, like my actual skin, obviously. Okay, so it takes a long time for it, the skin to absorb it. We'll see, the packaging is so cute though. Like, how can you not? I walked and I saw this and that's honestly, I'm huge on packaging. I'm a sucker for packaging. If you see something and it looks cute, I'm like, oh my God, I want that. So I saw this and plus on the display, <laughs> it was like a picture of the cutest little baby. And I'm like, oh, so I got it. All right, my face is absorbing it more. I, where I put it around where I want, you know, the pores to be more minimized, it still hasn't absorbed it completely. I want it to kind of set a little bit because I do feel a little nervous before I put any foundation on over this, but it's like silky. Almost a little too silky though, I'll be honest with you. I'm kind of like, Ugh, I don't know what's gonna happen feels nice on the skin I just I really hope my skin absorbs it all because otherwise it's like I mean I don't know if you can tell on my fingers but like look at that shine I'm worried <laughs> I'm kind of worried I'll be honest with you that's like a lot of shine especially for someone whose skin gets oily throughout the day I hope it proves me wrong though I hope I'm not like freaking myself out all right we'll see I'll let it sit for a little bit and then I'm gonna apply my foundation and everything and head over to work because I'm running so late. 9.14 and I should be on my way to work now. If anyone's watching at work, sorry, I'll make it there on time anyway. So, all right, I'm doing my makeup now. We'll see how the makeup lays over this and I'll check in. Okay, so I put my foundation and everything on. Um, I still feel like I have Vaseline on my face, like trolling jelly. I'm not, I'm gonna try my hardest not to touch my face. That's a really bad habit I have. I touch my face a lot, which is not good, but um, I'm not setting it. I really want to, but I just wanna see how it works on its own. So if I'm like an oily mess by the end of the night, I did it for you guys. So um, it kind of like, I guess the pores do look smaller. They do, I'll give it that. I, I do feel like I put like, what's that called, aquaphor? 
something yeah not as intense but along those lines you know what i mean so hopefully everything's just gonna set and my skin's just gonna like suck it up all night but i mean all day so we'll see i'll check in on you guys hi so it's now 305 in the afternoon i'm currently at work right now so i'm in the break room taking a moment just to update you guys um, everything did kind of set a little bit. I think most of it was absorbed by my skin. It definitely did minimize the appearance of my pores, which is, I guess, you know, the main purpose. So I'm happy with that. It does what it said it would do so far. Um, my skin, I think, might be oily by tonight, but that's normal. That is expected with my type of skin. Like, I'm used to it and everything. But And that's also that I didn't use any sort of setting spray or setting powder or anything. Um, so... So far, so good. I'm actually really happy with it. I'm so glad it didn't get as oily as I thought. You definitely still kind of feel it a little bit, but like I said, most of it is absorbed by my skin, so that's great. And also, you know, my makeup's still pretty good. Like, it's in place. It's not shifting or anything. So in terms of using it as a primer, it's doing a good job for that as well. And so far, I'm pretty happy with it. Okay, so it's the end of the night. It's 9.30, and... So overall, my pores still aren't as noticeable as they usually would be. I mean, obviously after 12 hours, my makeup's not going to be perfect and everything, but my skin feels good, which is nice. It feels smooth. Um, if you do like really feel for it, you definitely can still feel the product under there, like under all the makeup. And it's not your skin usually gets oily throughout the day or at least how my skin usually gets oily throughout the day like I actually feel the product it doesn't feel like natural oils it feels like how the product felt so I don't know if that's a good thing because it meant that it stayed on for that long or um, if it's a bad thing I mean if you don't like the feel of that but it definitely did its job like I feel like my pores aren't as noticeable on my skin the texture looks more even and smooth which is nice because i feel like my pores are really noticeable um it's really just the feel of the product on your skin and if you go to touch your skin and the feel of the product there it takes some getting used to but overall i am happy with it because it does minimize the appearance of my pores and that's the main purpose for it and my uh, foundation didn't really transfer anything or come off it's it lasted pretty well i mean obviously my makeup's running and everything but it's the end of the night what are you gonna do this is definitely a go for me does exactly what it says it does erase my pores and everything so i recommend it it's a go